In this podcast, we're going to look at a quick way to make sure that the dates for items in your course, like quizzes or drop boxes and things like that, are set to the proper date and that uh, they're on the calendar. And you know, as you set up discussion forums and quizzes and things, and you set the date restrictions, there's a little checkbox there to put it on the calendar. And sometimes you don't get the checkbox checked and it's, to go back and double check on that, you gotta go into each item. Now you can always go in and check your dates. So if I would go to things like assessments and quizzes, I can see here that I have my due date set for each of the quizzes, but I can't tell without going to each item if it's actually on the um, calendar. And I guess I can't, I mean, I can go back here to uh, the home page and, and then scroll through all the calendar items and everything. But a quick way to check on this is to use one of the tools uh, under edit course. So we're going to go to tools, edit course, and we're going to go to manage dates. And under manage dates, it shows us all of the items that are on our various tools. So we have discussions, grades, drop boxes. What I want to do right now is just look at my quizzes and make sure that the dates are right. And I want to see if they're on the calendar. So I'm going to select specific tool and select quizzes. I'm going to, then I have to click apply filter, the button here. And when I do that, I get just my quizzes showing up. And then I have, I can see the end date for each of them. If I had a starting date on them, those would appear here. But I actually open these up. These are really set up for, as study guides. And I leave them open from the beginning of the semester and they can work ahead if they like. But one thing I want to do is I want to make sure all of the due dates are on the calendar. And you can see here that I have my due dates so I can double check that the dates are appropriate with my course schedule, and they are. And the other thing is, there's a column, the next to the last column here is calendar. And if there's a check in that box, that means the item is on the calendar. So you can tell real quickly if one of your items didn't get the check box selected as it was set up and it is not on the calendar. So this is a quick way to double check. And once again, uh, you could do that with draw boxes, with discussions. You can also, there's many other uses for this tool. And we have other podcasts on it. Uh, one of the, some of the things you can do are actually do bulk um, editing of dates. So if you have like three assignments and they have the same date range for start and ending, you could select those three items. And then if, when you check the boxes there, you would hit the um, edit dates and it will let you edit the dates for all three items at the same time. So it's a real quick way to, to update things. So you can check out our other podcasts on this tool, but I thought this was a quick way to let you check your content to make sure you got the right due dates and you got the items on the calendar. Mm -hmm.